Can you speak to the impact uh, that cortisol and, and chronic stress has when it comes to trying to lose fat and trying to build muscle? Yeah. So I think cortisol also has gotten a bad rap because we need it. It's it's an essential hormone yeah. for our body, right? True, true, true. We need it because we have a cortisol awakening response. It naturally comes up and allows us to wake up. It also winds down, allows us to kind of relax to get to sleep. And mm -hmm. it allows us to respond to a stress if we're all of a sudden slamming on the brakes, we're like, ah, right. So it's really necessary for our survival. And with weight but what's not as well, it's good. It's good yeah. Uh, response. Exactly. Yeah, totally. Yeah. But what's not good is when we're in that highly stressed response and our baseline cortisol is elevated. So we're fluctuating between an elevated ba baseline and a new high. Mm. So we need to find ways of downturning that. Because if we don't find ways of downturning that, then we're always in that tired but wired state, which is a stress state for the body. And if we're in that stress state, it's not going to allow you to lose weight. It's not going to allow you to change body composition. So when we're looking at how do we mitigate that, it is, again, let's look at our circadian rhythm. Let's eat half an hour after, well, not you don't have to have a full meal, but have some food at half an hour after waking up to kind of mm -hmm. tell the brain, yep, we're up, we're ready to go. We have some food. It's fine. We can start allowing that cortisol to come down. Mm -hmm. um, when we get into a stressful situation and we're in a meeting that's really stressful at work or the kids are you know, around you and they're really fighting and stuff, you just take a deep breath and you it really does help. I mean, we talk about breath work in some situations, but taking a deep breath and controlling your breathing helps you it's kind of relax and bring more of a parasympathetic response, which makes you more stress resilient. Mm -hmm. So there are small things to do during the day when you're starting to see those stress points to kind of bring cortisol down. And when you get more control of that upper baseline to bring it down, then your body's like, okay, now I can concentrate on manipulating things I don't need, like bringing more active tissue up and getting rid of some of the less active tissue. Mm, totally makes sense. Thank you for breaking it down. I think that's so important. Like it's a lot of women don't realize how much stress can have. Like an, it's a silent killer to progress. So being able to, absolutely, yeah, like you can't out train a nervous system that's in overdrive essentially. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. And the other thing is give yourself permission to not train, give yourself permission not to rush, give yourself permission to go outside and sit in the sun and have a cup of coffee or just stare at the sun. Like it is okay. You don't have to jam your day full of go, 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 go all the time because we're not designed to do that. Mm, I just love that you just touched on that because I think a lot of pe people and women and, and and men just try to like power through their day and don't yes. try to like slow down and 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 so and like like soften a bit. You know, like it's okay to do that. Yeah. <laughs> it's the hustle culture we live in. <laughs> it is. That was like, I was at the gym this morning and I'm the American surrounded by all the New Zealanders or the Kiwis. And they're like, what was your trip like last? And so I was explaining my days when I'm in the States, because my days in the States are really, really jammed. I know it's a short period of time, but super, super jammed. And they all turn and go, oh my gosh, they like workhorse you to death. That culture is just like, go, 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 go. I couldn't live there. And then in my head, I'm like, yeah, but it's a bit too slow here. <laughs> <laughs> it's, just, it's the mix, right? I've had to the work the California mindset out of me to understand that things take a little bit longer and it's okay. <laughs> but you know, it's, it's, it's funny that you touched on that is it is a Western culture thing. Like it is like totally it the U S just hustle grind, like push, you know, that's just the vibe here. <laughs> but, I know. <laughs> that's so funny. That we, that. Now we have a society of underslept overfed sick people and we need to reverse that amen yes oh yeah I, it's been a breath of fresh air having a conversation with you it's uh it, i love your brain and the way you break things down and make it just really simple to understand and the message that you just continue to pour that you continue to pour out into uh the people that need to hear it it's just thank you for your work and what oh, you do thanks i appreciate it